Good morning, and welcome to St. Paul's Lutheran Church on Sunday, April 18th. In this community, as we journey with Christ, each other, and the neighbors God gives us, we welcome and embrace all people made in God's rich diversity of race, culture, sexual orientation, gender identity and expression, social and economic circumstances, and abilities. We invite you and the family that surrounds you into this faith community as we learn, explore, and grow together in our understanding of God and the world. You are welcome here. Before we begin worship with the Thanksgiving for baptism, I wanted to acknowledge that a few days ago, a young man in Minnesota named Dante Wright was killed by a police officer. Many across our nation and across this community have been deeply troubled by this killing, yet another killing of a young black man by a police officer. I implore all of you to be in prayer about the racial relations in this country, about an end to white supremacy in our nation. And if your prayer moves you into further action, stemming out of your faith, I ask that you would contact either myself or Pastor Mark to ask more about the anti-racism work that we at St. Paul's are doing. In the meantime, let us all pray. Lord Jesus Christ, your own mother looked on when your life ended in violence. Our hearts are pierced with grief and anger at the death of Dante Wright. We commend the slain to your wounded hands and their loved ones to your merciful heart, trusting only in the promise that your love is stronger than death and that even now you live and reign forever. Amen. And now let us begin our worship with the thanksgiving for baptism. Alleluia! Christ is risen. Christ is risen indeed. Alleluia! Refreshed by the resurrection life we share in Christ, let us give thanks for the gift of baptism. We thank you, risen Christ, for these waters where you make us new leading us from death to life, from tears to joy. We bless you, risen Christ, that your spirit comes to us in the grace-filled waters of rebirth, like rains to our thirsting earth, like streams that revive our souls, like cups of cool water shared with strangers. Breathe your peace on this church when we hide in fear. Clothe us with your mercy and forgiveness. Send us companions on our journey as we share your life. Make us one risen Christ. Cleanse our hearts. Shower us with life. To you be all, given all praise with the Holy Spirit in the glory of God now and forever. Amen. Now let us pray. Holy and righteous God, you are the author of life, and you adopt us as your children. Fill us with your words of life that we may live as witnesses to the resurrection of your Son, Jesus Christ, our Savior, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. Amen. 